Welcome back everyone to episode 12 of the Sim SMP. And um, yeah, in this episode I try to implement a new mod that I just found. It's called Replay Mod. Um, it simply it records all the loaded chunks around you whilst you play. It doesn't interfere with any of your gameplay. And in the end you can, with a third person camera, go through the world, look at it, um, you'll see some parts, um, yeah, so this is the first time with me using the mod, so if there's like some weird parts where the camera bugs around, it's totally my fault, the mod works perfectly, just want to say that, uh, there's one sad thing, today, um, we had to throw out Finn from the CIA, because he broke the contract, I'll explain it later in the video, and yeah. Let's hop in into the first time lapse. Right, hello, um, we are back on the SMP again. Um, I have a bad thing, a sad thing that I need to tell. So, I will quickly blend in some chat screenshots that I made uh, because a friend of mine who played on the server, the one German friend, um, he broke a rule. So, now we need to yeah, technically break his contract. So I'll quickly show the images and then we'll come back to this. Alright, so um, yeah, uh, this is the first part of the chat. As you see, I just joined back because I got kicked, because I apparently dropped a few sticks too quickly, I don't know what. The program Eternals thought I maybe like hacked or something, but I didn't. So yeah, um, I wrote to slash the stream is delayed, but that's not very interesting. So like we talked for a bit, and um, then I noticed, hang on, someone's at my chests because I want to co collect more snow, but I didn't know where my chest is. So I asked, where the flip is my, s where's my shit? And my friend was like, yo, what do you mean? But my my friend is Finoop, and I was like, yo, someone's at my chests. Yeah, stuff wasn't it, and that's like, I believe her. Then he said, "Yo, um, only took the shulker chest out of the middle," and I was like, "Wait, the one from me?" And then, yeah, I don't know, but I wasn't at your place. 
And that was like, hang on, why the heck would you go to my chest? I was like, yo, you can quickly give me that back, definitely. He like, M was me, uh, it's mine. He's like, yo, I'm over 8,000 blocks away. I'm like, why should I care? Like, I was pissed at that point, so I just was like, give me my, give me my shaka trust back. And then, like, because, mate, you, you took it with no permission, and that obviously breaks the rule. I'll show that in the next clip again. Because that I'll read the contract again. And we discussed and I was clear oh, where is it then? He said it's in the under chest. So it could be possible he really just wanted to save it, but still it's against the rules. I was like, yo, then TP me. Like if you want to back ASAP, then TP me. I'm like, no. First of all no. Definitely not possible. Like I'm not allowed to TP you. And second of all, I was at his chest to see if I could find it. And he had a wither. Uh, he had an armored wither skull. And he was like very new, so I was like, you can't tell me you killed. Him. So, if you don't know, like we got hacked in the last part in the last video. And I'm starting to get sus about him. Like it could obviously just be possible that he killed him, but still, it's just. Mm, hang on there so yeah we just like talk about it and he was like yo what the fuck are you actually at my stuff and I'm like yo first of all I'm allowed to watch like I can look in your chest as long as I don't take stuff out I'm allowed to look in it and second I still don't believe him that it is how it is yeah and that was the end from the chat in the end um, as you may see in the next clip I'll uh, take some diamonds from him to get the 30 diamond fee, we have no contract. And yeah, contract expert and yada yada, you will see it in the next part. So yeah, let's cut back. Right, now that we've done that, um, yeah, so you have already signed from the CIA. Uh, if you didn't know, he was a member. And yeah, because obviously, here's his contract. And this contract states that he will check if the rules are broken, and he will take action if they are, and he will like check everything, yada yada yada. Um, yeah. So it like goes on. Then here he actually says that he did read the contract. He will stay with the rules by himself, which he obviously didn't. He stole my charcoal chest, and he knows that if he breaks. Any rule himself, he will be thrown out of the investigation agency, aka the CIA. You have to pay a fee of 30 diamonds due to breaking your contract. He signed it. He broke it. So now, we'll have to take the fee. So let's quickly walk over to his house. And take the fee, because technically, we are allowed by the rules. He did sign the contract, he knew the risk of taking the shulker box. Of course, people can now say in the comments, well, yes, he just wanted to save it, yada, yada, yada. When the contract says, yeah, guard everything like it's your own. Yes, but taking something without telling someone is breaking a rule because he's stealing. B, um, the contract technically just specifies buildings. And yeah, well, items, yes, but there were just some snow blocks in it, and we know that no one would steal some snow blocks. And like Shaka chest, everyone has them, so it's not really guarding them, it's just like you need it, you ask, but he didn't ask even, and he used it, which I know. So technically, he took it for his own purpose, which is stealing. So yeah, this is his house. And I've looked through his chest. He only has a total of 22 diamonds. But I mean, he has tools, so we can still get the fee. So we have th uh, 23. I will not take enchanted stuff. 23. So he still has a fee of 7 diamonds. But like. I did do my investigations and I know that there's a chest back here. But I don't know if the chest has like valuable stuff. Nope, just has okay. So seven diamonds left. 
I'll give him the two, the two sticks back. So you can't say I, I stole him two sticks. Uh, yeah. So I'll write him that he still has a fee of seven diamonds open. And yeah, if he asks where his diamonds went, we'll tell him that the contract states that I, um, that he will pay the fee of 30 diamonds when he breaks any rule. He broke the rule, so he needs to pay the fee. Simple. Or he took uh, 23, he needs to pay 30, so he still has 7 open, and that he will need to pay them. Alright then, we are back in my base once again, and yeah, so, we are actually somewhere where we have been before. As you may see, I deactivated my coordinates again, so people can't track me to where I am. It's getting night right now, that's not bad. Just hop down here, quickly run over, and go to sleep. So. Um, yeah, as you may see, Nasty's private farm, and yeah, like, look at it, it's finished, the whole base is built inside the hill, so actually terraformed, and buttons inside the upper room over there, trigger the water which will flow down everything in the water streams down here, to go down there into these chests, which I will show, in just a second because I've been AFK in here for a bit and everything is set so the food all flooding and as you see some stuff will get stuck that's why you always flood twice just so you get like almost everything outside and we'll run through these water streams down here you can't see it here because I think we've catched everything, but let's just show it on this side. Here both get triggered at one time. This just splits so it makes it easier. And let's see if we can catch some stuff floating by. There you can see how some stuff like really fast flows by. But as you see, a lot of stuff gets stuck because the water doesn't go by as fast as it should. So let the slab float twice. Some stuff will still be stuck on the slabs or bugs back. No problem. So we have these doors. Problem is that the redstone obviously activates these trap doors as well. I forgot to add to here. Uh, I'll do that in a second. And yeah, we can go outside here, walk down and like collect everything that became stuck or is still stuck. On this side it's uh, mostly wheat seeds, which means we can just replant all of this again. It's so, like, look at that, almost nine stacks of wheat seeds, damn. And over here, like, all of the food gets stuck as well. So that's like a little problem, just because the water stream doesn't stay along, uh, long, and some stuff gets on these slabs. The thing is I need to keep the slab so I can like go down without breaking these because if I go from a whole block I would break it. Most of the time. So as you see, pretty simple. Waterlocked sla uh, waterlock trap doors get activated by redstone. It just floats down the water into the streams which run along here and in the end here yeah, are some simple hoppers which just lead down here to the collection system so like we can put all of this stuff again like in the system because like we don't need it right now um, I will just refill them um, in a second if you go through here there's actually like a secret pathway just to the redstone pretty simple to the filters here and yeah um, yeah. As you may see, um, you don't see actually that there's something behind the portal, that's why I made it, um, like concrete, so you can't see it. And here just like some caution si style 
like railing and yeah that's like all of it just have a little window here I will extend it so with like pumpkin melon farms whatever I'll come up with as well like as you may see back there's a village so maybe like something with villagers maybe like an iron farm I need to see so yeah that's like most of it which I wanted to show you and I'll get back designing so see you in the next part
Hey boys, found one. After all of the time searching, finally I've found one. Took some time, definitely did. But boys, we found one. Since smack this B. Aw, oh, hell no. Ain't no bee attacking me with that. So I thought, yoink, gimme. Yeah, moolah boy. Did some offline searching because I just did not want to stream that anymore. It just became sad. Doing some of these blocks for them hats outside the bra. Sheep. Okay, back again. This time I came prepared with rockets. I already got my stuff back. Let's grab this hat. Up. And come on, yeah, boy. By the way, I had to bring a iron pickaxe as well because obviously. The original one broke. Alright, quite the event for two weeks. Uh, yeah, as we may have seen, Finn flew out of the CIA. I made the Winter Wonderland. Um, I got on Lytra, at least something good, something good. Uh, I continued the whole, and yeah. So, this was the 12th episode. Hope you liked it. Uh, if not, bad. <laughs> um, yeah, if you have any critique, uh, leave it down in the comments. Open for everyone. And yeah, see you in the next video, and goodbye.